Hey, what's going on guys? Ralph Joseph here at St. Albert Dodge. What I got right next to me here is this 2021 Jeep Compass Trailhawk in this laser blue color here. But first and foremost, folks, we got to take a look to see what's underneath the hood. All right, powered by a 2.4 liter, four banger, eight speed automatic transmission uh, here. And anywhere you guys see the yellow, that's where you guys top up, you guys check, you guys fuel, you guys touch. The rest you leave up to the mechanics in the back here. Since it's a trail hawk, you got the two red uh, hooks in the front and one in the back as well. And since it's a, a Jeep, you know, you got the nice little Jeep, you know, representation in the front there. 17 inch alloy wheels with the, the black and the silver on it, which is a nice little feature there. On this one as well, you got the roof rail. So if you want to put some roof racks, put some stuff up here, you can. And the blind spot monitoring detective system to check your blind spot so you're not crashing into anyone which is a nice little feature. If we move on to the back, uh, we got the, the uh, <laughs> we got the tow hooks in the back here, which is nice red to match the front, you know, uh, make sure everything is nice, uh, cylindrical and linear. You got the cameras in the back here as well. And if we pop open this tailgate, you got nice, very spacious trunk right here, you know, which is nice. You got your spare tire as well, not just a compressor or a, a compressed sealant air compressor. So you get the spare tire, which is nice. And you know, this thing is equipped with a lot of options. We're gonna close that and let's take a look on the inside, see what we're working with. Hey, what's going on guys? Ralph Joseph here at St. Albert Dodge. And I'm just here to show you the inside of this 2021 Jeep Compass Trailhawk. Um, first and foremost, this thing is equipped with a nice leather and kind of a mesh combination. Uh, you know, you know, it's a, more of like a Trailhawk feel to it. So you get in there, you know, you're getting to something nice, which is, which is good on the left side here if we work our way into the left side you got your power windows you got your power locks which is pretty self-explanatory there which is nice and just out here you got your auto lights and, and um if we take a look at the steering wheel it's a nice uh size shape steering wheel not too small not too big leather wrapped as well with the red stitching that nice trailhawk accent on the right side here you got your cruise control with your uh adaptive cruise control as well and on the left side here you got your cluster dash navigation um, and once your phone is connected via Bluetooth or Android Auto, Apple CarPlay, you'll be able to answer and end phone calls and either use the um, uh, Siri that's attached to your phone or Bixby or um, whatever, you know, voice command you have on here or use the one from this vehicle, which is nice. On the back of the steering wheels, on the right side, you got your volume up, which is nice. Here on the left side, you can kind of change the channels or go between the stations, which is nice. Keep your hands on a steering wheel at all times. And um, this one is heated steering wheel and heated seats as well. So you can keep nice and warm and toasty for those long winter months that we have in this uh, city here. 8.4 inch screen, Sirius XM, FM. Um, you can connect your Bluetooth, aux, USB, all straight from here. Touch screen as well. Um, climate control as well. And so I'll do climate control. So whatever is hot, cold, you don't have to fight over the temperature anymore. You guys can choose what you like. You can either operate it from here, down here, or simply just put it in the auto mode and allow it to, you know, set it and forget it type of deal, which is a nice little feature. You can, you can access the controls either from the bottom here or from directly in the con climate control system. Heat of seats, heat of steering wheel, self-explanatory there, which is nice. And you come equipped with a navigation so if you don't want to use a navigation on your phone use that data you can just simply just use it straight from uh, the vehicle here which is nice and once your phone is connected it will display on here and of course your settings to out you know navigate it and customize it the way you see fits best which is nice if we move down a little bit you can mute the music at any point in time and turn off the screen at any point in time so let's say if it's a little bright for those uh, dark nights turn it off Park sense as well and lane assist as well, uh, which it comes equipped with, which is nice. Um, climate control navigation just at the bottom here right now, right here, which you can either uh, do your thing with on here or on the touchscreen. But I find sometimes it's nice to kind of have this so you know where it's at. You just boom, boom, boom without having to worry about exactly pressing it on the screen there, which is a nice feature to have the, uh, the mix and the match there. You got your select terrain down here, whether you want it in snow, sand, mud, rock with a twist it kind of goes into it in the cluster dash uh adjusts to it as well um or if you want it in sand or mud or rock um it allows you to do it. what i like to do though 
go all the way to the top and keep it in that auto. It's the type of set it and forget it type of feel where I don't have to think about which road condition am I riding in or forget or whatever the case may be. I like to keep it in that auto. Of course, you got the four wheel drive low and the four wheel drive lock to lock all of them um, if you wanted to as well. And of course, you got your, you know, hill descent. Yeah, your USB and your aux right here, 12 volts. Couple of stores right here. Put your, you know, change knickknack paddy wax down here. You got your engine off and on right here as well with your cruise control e brake, electronic e brake. You got some cup holders and just in here, you got a little little storage in here as well, which is nice. Um, and you got 115 volt behind here as well. So if you want to connect something a little bit more power that needs a little bit more juice, like a laptop, um, you know, iPhone set up with the USB, a toaster. An oven. Who knows? Let's say if you want to get some juice, you're out camping. You need you need that source. This vehicle comes equipped. Last but not least, this thing it comes equipped with a panoramic sunroof. So while you're camping, you're out and it's chilly or it's hot or it's raining, put the seats all the way back, folk. Enjoy the nice view in the midnight skies, which is my all-time feature in this vehicle. But to know more about this vehicle, just come on down and come see me, Ralph Joseph. Um, or you can simply call me directly on my cell phone or text me. I do both. Phone number to reach me at 780-293-9444. I look forward to it. Okay.